We all want to be that special, unique butterfly, but the only way to get there is to become a purple cow. Keep watching to find out what book I'm talking about today. Hey, it's Kyla Donagno, and today we're talking all about how to make yourself and your business a special, unique butterfly slash purple cow, <laughs> okay? Today we're talking about the book, Purple Cow. The author of the book is Seth Godin. The genre of the book is nonfiction. The theme of the book is business entrepreneurship, okay? So the tagline of this book is transform your business by being remarkable. So what does it mean to be remarkable, right? Seth literally puts the definition in here and it's like remarkable, able to leave a mark over and over and over again. And so the title of the book comes from a trip that he was taking. He was out with his family and they were looking at the cows and they were like, oh my God, look, there's so many cows, look, they're beautiful, look at them, blah, 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 blah. And they keep driving and they stop talking about the cows and they start talking about something else. And he's like, what if you saw a purple cow, right? Like I know Jersey has brown and white cows and some other places have black and white cows, and but a purple cow, you would be talking about it the whole trip. Was that cow really purple? No, I think it was fuchsia. Oh my God, I wanna see it again. Oh look, there's another one you would be obsessed, okay? And so to become remarkable, for people to be able to make remarks about it over and over and over again, to leave an impression over and over and over again, you need to make your business into a purple cow. The first thing that Seth says is that it's not about your ideas. Being remarkable is about how you execute them, okay? So you're watching this book review. I read the book, I thought, hey, I can't wait to talk about it. Well, everybody's doing book reviews. What do I do that makes it remarkable? For one, you got my silly laugh. For two, you got me saying all right after every sentence. For three, you have me recording with this beautiful background with all my plants. But honestly, it's the gifts. It's the movement. It's the energy that I bring. It's the fact that you can tell, okay, she didn't just read this book for a book report. She actually enjoys reading, right? I own multiple businesses. So when I read books about business, Listen, I am learning. <laughs> I am learning, I am writing notes, and that's why I make these book reviews because it's a constant little recorded nugget of all the stuff that I've learned so I can go back and say, do I wanna reread that book? Let me watch the review. I do. Let me figure out new ways to become remarkable. Let me find out a new way that I can execute my ideas and become successful, right? So with that said, would I reread this book? Yes, absolutely yes, okay? But I do wanna read you a quick list of other ways that you can be remarkable, all right? So Seth Godin says, what if you actually told the truth? What if you didn't have to outsmart or be outboring or be outstanding or be louder or bigger or brasher or crazy? What if you just told the truth? What if your business was, I make videos that are entertaining and that people will come back and watch over and over again, period. Well, what's remarkable about that? Okay, people coming back over and over and over again, you make videos, so that means you're consistent in making the video. People wanna come back. Well, what will make someone come back? Well, you add a little bit of humor, you add a little bit of sincerity, you add a Barbie t-shirt, you add some energy, you add some color, you add all this stuff, right? All of those things, right? And so the funniest part about the book is that Seth Godin is well, well renowned for marketing and for writing books about marketing. And what he likes to say is that marketing is easy. You make an idea, you tell 10 people about it, and those 10 people are then to tell the world. If you have a remarkable idea, if you have a remarkable business, if you have a remarkable product, you just need to tell a couple people. Everybody else will tell people, oh my God, did you see Kyla's video? Oh my goodness, this was so funny. Oh my gosh, I will. they will do it. If you have a remarkable product, it will spread. But again, it's not about the idea and the product, it's about how you execute it. So if your execution is remarkable and you telling the 10 people and then they constantly wanna come back, they constantly wanna tell other people, you will have yourself a purple cow, all right? I know that is so much easier said than done. This is definitely a book that I will keep rereading over and over. For one, typically I, I hold the books this way, right? But the words are, are literally horizontal. <laughs> this book is to even be remarkable when it's sitting on your shelf. So it's definitely one that I will reread multiple times, okay? So if you're enjoying this book review, take a look at this review here. The book is called Attention, This Book Will Make You Money and the book did make me money, all right? So I'll see you in the next review.